Okay, so this time in four days, I'm gonna be gone and I'm only just starting to pack, which is fine, it's fine. But look at the look at the mess right now. Okay, so I've started to put like my dance stuff underwear in here. I've got my gym stuff here, some pajamas here, my dance shoes, rubbish and the bag that I need to clear out, stuff that needs to go in the wash. Old stuff I don't need. Jumpers, and I need to start deciding what jumpers I'm going to take. There's loads in the wash as well. All my joggers and cargoes are in the wash. I've started to pack my towels. It's honestly just a mess right now. And I just remembered I need to pack shoes. So, um, I don't really know where to start and how to pack it. I guess it doesn't really matter because it's all going to come out. But I've kind of got my dance stuff that I definitely need. And like underwear, I think I'm gonna pack like pajamas in there, and my gym stuff. Gym stuff's more for like as in training. I wear my gym shorts and stuff. And then in the other suitcase, I need to put my cargoes, my joggers, my jumpers. I think I'm gonna need another suitcase. Mm. That's a lot I need to do. There's a lot I need to do, and I'll be there in four days. But it's okay. I got it. I just realised I need to pack. Oh my god, I'm gonna for some shoes as well. I need to take my pillows off my bed. I need to change my sheets so I can take my duvet with me and my sheets with me. Take these pillows. Yeah. You know what, though? It's all actually starting to come together. I've just sorted my gym stuff out. Oh, I say I've sorted it out, so I've got, like, a few sets. Blue set, brown set, green set, and then, like, four other pair of shorts. And then, like three tops it seems a lot but i'm training for like three and a half weeks and i'll probably mostly wear my gym stuff so i'll just take it all because what's the harm even though i got two suitcases but i'll just have to get enough one out of the loft um i'm looking at oh, what am i gonna take yeah i've got so much to choose from i just don't know what to take i'm so excited i literally can't believe i'm gonna be there in four days okay so I just don't even know how to pack, but does it really matter that much? But then I guess if I packed properly, I could probably fit it in better. But it's okay. I'll just chuck it on top of all my underwear. Because this is only small. Maybe I should roll it. No, we're not going to roll it. It's going to be all good. It's going to be fine. It's going to be fine. <sighs> Four days. Four days and I will be there. I can't wait to meet Serena. Um, and my whole team, obviously, but obviously I'll be living with Serena, so I'm looking forward to meeting her, um, doing all the shows. I'm pretty certain I know the shows now. I'm very confident to, well, pretty confident to say I could go up and do a few of the shows now. Um, I'd say there's one and a bit of another one that I could, bit, might go a bit wrong on, but overall, it's alright. And then, obviously, you learn all the dance routines as well, so that might throw me off with the lyrics, but I'm hoping I'll be okay. I'm really putting this in randomly now, I should probably concentrate. But, but no, yeah, I cannot wait. Mother's ironing my clothes for me. <laughs> I've got a pile here that needs to be ironed and she hasn't done it yet. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Hello. Okay, so before we go on to talk about me having three days until I go, I'm going to take you back to... Tuesday, it's Friday today, where I get my hair dyed and I get it straightened for a few days, so roll to that. Hello guys, so I am going to get my hair dyed and straightened today. I'm getting it darker because basically this is wet, but when it's dry, it's gone quite a bit lighter now, so I'm going to get it touched up, going to get it darker and straightened because when she does my hair, my auntie always straightens it for me. So let's go. So I'm going to take my light thing with me so I can try and feel some transitions. But I need my hair to dry because I need to do tra some transitions videos. But I'm excited. Let's go. We are here. This is my hat. As you can see, it's already gone a bit lighter. This bit's still wet. So I just want to get it touched up. And it would just get straight in if she does that one and get my head up. Let's go. Okay, I can speak now because um, it's only me in here. But they put the... My auntie's put the dye in. Um, as you can see, it's quite a bit darker. Um, okay, I've got a filter on. I did not realize I had a filter on. But yeah, the dye is in, and now it's been sat for like half an hour. It's got to wait a bit longer. And we can take it out, wash it, and straighten it. Um, but yeah, anyway, like I was saying, we're going to leave this in a little bit longer, wash it, 
take it out, cut it a little bit, straighten it. Yeah, can't wait. And I was told that my hair looks a lot healthier now because last time I came here, it was so bad. Like, it was like, it was so short. It was just not good hair. But apparently it looks a lot better. So that's good. Been using good products. So, and I'm not stressed anymore. So I think a lot of it was to do with stress. Look a lot better. Okay, so I forgot to film earlier, so um, this has been a few hours, I've been out and about, I've been bowling, I've been outside, so it's not as straight anymore, but I'm obsessed with the colour. Look how much darker it is, like, oh my gosh, I love it. Okay, I know some of you are probably thinking, it's not like, the straight hair doesn't suit you. I know, but I just like my auntie doing it when I get my hair done, like, twice a year. Um, I can't wait to see what it's going to look like curly, and it's grown so much. About four months ago when I got my hair done, it was literally up here. And then these bits, like my hair's starting to grow back, and these bits were like here last time, and now they're right down here. But yeah, I love it. I'll show you it when it's curly in a few days. And when I start packing to go away, but yeah. Bye. Okay, it's good. Seriously. We have to ignore this. <laughs> However, three days. Three days, and I will be there. That's scary. Um, I need to practice this show, the twist show, because this is the one I'm least confident on, and I feel like this is the one we're gonna do first because it's like the longest, and it's the one that's gonna have the most dancing in it, I think. So I have a feeling we might do this one first. So. I need to make sure I know this. It's, it's back curly now. Um, yeah, I love the colour. I love it. But anyway, and then tomorrow, um, I'm going to put my fake nails on and I'm going to tan. I am so pale. I have never been this pale. Well, I haven't been this pale for months. But I wanted to tan like four days ago. And I was like, no, that's silly. Because if you want to re-tan on the weekend, it's going to be patchy. So I've just, it's all off. It is all off. Um, today I didn't, I got a tattoo as well, I got a tattoo, can you see, wait, oh I got four, okay I'll show you a picture, I'll add it in here, I got that last week as well, because I wanted to get that done before I went away, um, but yeah, I need to finish a bit of packing, stuff like that and prep this, but I'll see you guys, I might have more of an update, but in three days I'll be there, he's back, oh, hello, hello Baba. I'm back. What's wrong? Hey. Ready. Ready, ready, ready. Go get it. I'm gonna get it. Get it. Are you waiting for mum to get back? Are you waiting for mum to get back? Yeah. <laughs> Squeak it then. Squeak it. <laughs> mum, you're gonna tell us what we have? Yeah, tell us food. No. Okay. We've got onion ring. Oh no! We've got spicy chicken wings, barbecue chicken wings, garlic bread, onion rings and nuggets. Oh no, chicken skewers, onion rings and nuggets. Uh, I don't know, it's vegetable swing rolls, jerk chicken, pizza, sausage rolls, tandoori chicken, apparently, and more stuff. I don't know, a lot. Oh, and wedges. And, oh, Indian selection. You can't tell me that cheese and pineapple is not the best thing. Okay. Oh my gosh. I'm hungry. He's broke the vibe already, but this is what I, my concoction I made. Look how cute. Delicious. I'm sure I will have more, but this is what I'm having for now. Okay, so you have to know the absolute state of me, but it's Saturday night. So my last day at home is tomorrow. I leave Monday. Um, time to fake tan. Finally, I'm so pale. I cannot wait. I've been wanting to fake tan for about a week now. But I wanted it to all come off so I can be freshly tanned for Monday. So we're doing it. And then I'm whispering because it's midnight. And then I've got fake nails. Um, to put on tomorrow as well. But yeah, I'm whispering because it's literally midnight. Oh my god, I can't wait. Okay, yeah, it looks ridiculous right now, but it washes off, obviously, in the morning after I've had it on overnight. And 
I'm gonna get my bed sheets already covered in tan. It's so bad, but I'm gonna wash them tomorrow. But um, yeah, I'm gonna fake tan, and then oh my God, tomorrow is my last day properly in Swindon. But yeah, I'm gonna concentrate and fake. That's ridiculous. I know that's ridiculous, but once I wash it off, it obviously won't look like this. Yeah, I've got basically everything packed now. I've finished some bits off today. I should probably take my necklace off. Yeah, I've finished some bits today. Um, tomorrow, I just need to go to the shop and get some fresh food that I'm going to take with me. Um, I'm there for a month. I've packed clothes, food, hair stuff, makeup, everything. And I'm looking forward to meeting my team as well. We're going to the other park on the 29th, 28th of January. And then me and my roommate have made an agreement that I'll have the small room for the first four months. And then we'll swap and I'll have the bigger room for the last four months. It's the only fair way to do it. I suggested it and I think it's fair. Anyway, I need to take this top off. So I'll see you guys in the morning. We're taking all my suitcases downstairs because you should have seen it a minute ago. There was so much stuff. I have so much stuff to pack in this car tomorrow. We've just got our, my final bit, so we went to Aldi, then went to M&S, and now we're in Asda. I was getting our final fresh, oh my God, fresh food, like mince, chicken, pizza, stuff like that. And then I literally, this time tomorrow, I would have left Swindon. Oh my gosh. Okay, the lighting's not great, but guys, tomorrow, is the day tomorrow is the day i move away this time tomorrow i'll probably just have got to the caravan park the training caravan park and then literally like the last like day of february i moved to the normal park for then eight months but yeah from tomorrow i will we'll be away for nine months i'm excited but also nervous but more excited than nervous but yeah Oh my gosh, I can't wait. Guys, I've just realised on that wall that I've lost my necklace. It's not in my jumper. How the hell, how the hell did I do that? I'm hoping it's fallen down when I've taken my coat off. Oh my god, I need to get that. Update, it was found. Oh my god, I was just running around for like 15 minutes. So I had to leave the house, like, now. Because um, my friend was picking me up and I was like, I'm not going to have time to do this 45 minute walk, like, again. But my mum's, like, I told my mum the route and she started walking it. She found it, but I was also running around outside for like 15 minutes too, but she found it. Thank the Lord. I was like, no way can I just lose that nice necklace I got for um, Christmas. But I found it, so it's okay. But my mum found it. Today is the day. Today is the morning. I've got to take this quilt with me. I've got my bags down. Oh. Well, all my suitcases are downstairs, but I've just packed my last minute, like, charges and stuff. Um, but yeah. I'm actually leaving in. Okay, I've still got like three and a half hours. Still, the bits of nails that last night—they're not the best, but they're just something. They feel cute. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna miss that. Okay, so I've just gotten changed. So I've gone for long sleeve top and a joggers moment because I didn't want to look really run down, but I also. So don't want to be too much just something like this just because i might see people when i get there and i don't want to look like a total rat when i haven't seen them for like nine months um but yeah i'm gonna go downstairs and i'll show you all the bags i have so many it's ridiculous i'm embarrassed by how much i have like i'm literally embarrassed but i'd rather have too much than not enough i've got to take them bags down in a minute i've just chucked my duvet over the banister I can take that with me. Yeah. Oh wait. Okay. Let me go and show you. Let's go. Okay. So food wise, I've got food, 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 food. I've got kitchen stuff. I've got bathroom stuff. More food. Coat hangers, and then here I've got even more stuff. I've got two suitcases here. I've got my um, hair dryer thing here. Bag here full of, I don't even know. This, so I can put my washing in it. This bag full of, honestly, I don't even know. Two pillows, my quilts, more pillows. So much stuff. Look at it. Oh my God, I literally can't believe I'm going right now. <laughs> it's so full. Oh, 